using the ssh.tmpl sample file in root on the Ansible host, write a template and playbook that will deploy the file on all hosts in the environment, turning off password authentication on all servers, and ensuring x1140 is on for admin servers only. So let's look at this ssh.tmpl file. Vim ssh.tmpl. So the two lines that we're interested in are this password authentication line and this x1140 line, line 16 and line 10. Rather than using a variable to replace the entire line, we really only care about yes and no here. So let's replace that with PA answer. And we'll replace this one with x11 answer. Now we need to write a playbook to deploy all that. Let's start it off. Name review task 9. Hosts all except for admins because the admins have a different requirement. Become yes. Set our vars here. PA answer no. X11 answer is no. Now we set up our tasks. Name apply template. Template module. We spell that right. And then source is root ssh.tmpl destination is as the ssh sshd config and especially when you're messing with ssh where a restart with the wrong configuration is going to just lock you out completely we want to do something to validate our config change we're going to call sbin sshd minus t for test and then we're going to pass it minus f percent s which will give it the string of the file name that Ansible is building everything into temporarily before it actually deploys it. And then, because any configuration change doesn't actually take effect until we restart the service, name restart shd service module name shd state restarted. And then since we accepted the admin group up at the top, we need to go ahead and apply it, especially here, 9b, hosts, admins, become, yes, bars, this is going to be very, very similar between the two, so I'm just going to copy and paste and we'll change the relevant lines. The only one we really need to care about is this one and change that to yes. It's still going to validate our config change. But before I exit this file, I want to actually fix this typo that I made. If you just say the word no here, Ansible is going to parse that and write false, not the word no. If you want it to be explicitly the word no, you actually have to quote it. So I'm going to go ahead and do that on all of these. And then we can drop out and run Ansible playbook ssh.yaml. Alright, so on the first part, it applied the template correctly. It, did, it skipped admin server, and then on the second half, it just did the admin server. Looks like it changed everything and we should be good to go.